Now we will look into the causal factor of vascular diseases, particularly strokes. And strokes also no, no, uh, known as infarction. Um, they block a brain artery, usually cause a range of symptoms that may include vascular dementia. So, both si symptoms, both si iski vaj, uh, iski se both si complications ho sakti hai. But one of the complications or one of the effect is um, in, in form of cognitive deficit. So, stroke is one reason. Uh, then, but some, there are some strokes which are uh, silent, which impact is not visible. Nahi hota. But they can also um, act as a risk factor for dementia or for cognitive deficit. So it is important that the silent uh, strokes or milder strokes should not be ignored. Uh, then uh, conditions that narrow um, or inflict long-term damage uh, to the brain body, uh, sorry, blood supply to the brain uh, or brain vessels, if there is an effect aega, like cholesterol, hai, ya other factors hain jo ki uski aapki brain ki jo blood supply uh, ki jo veins hain jo brain ke andar hain unko effect karte hain gradually to wo unki wajah se bhi they also can lead to vascular dementia uh, wear and tears associated with aging umar ke sath sath jo zahiri baat hai sare body jo organs hain unke andar wear tear ho rahi hoti hai similarly there is in brain uh, that can also cause one of the reason of stroke then high blood pressure is one of the factors. It's, it's very hypertension, jise kehte hain. It is important that it should be taken care of. Abnormal aging of blood vessels, which is known as um, atherosclerosis uh, and also diabetes, uh, diabetes or brain hemorrhage. So all these are um, the, the, the factors which result in stroke and these are the factors which eventually affect cognitive functioning and are the reason for uh, dementia or neurocognitive deficits. Then the next one is traumatic brain injury. As the name indicates, there is traumatic brain, uh, some, some uh, hitting the brain against something. And uske wajah se skull ke andar jo humara brain hai, wo displaced bhi ho sakta hai, usme lesion bhi ho sakti hai, hemorrhaging bhi ho sakti hai. So uh, falls are the most common cause of head injuries um, and falling poses an especially serious risk for older adults. Boodong ke andar, it's, it's a caution should be exercised ke wo head injury se unko bachaya jaye. Uh, of course, it is important to save everybody from head injury, but it particularly poses more risk to the ad, older adults kyunki unke andar already cognitive functioning jahe wo deteriorate kar rahi hoti hai due to aging process. Or on top of that, agar head injury ho jayegi, to that would create more serious um, issue or concern or a risk. Uh, then motor vehicle crashes are another common cause of head injuries. Joke uh, young logo mein bahut zada hote hain because they are the one who don't exercise or um, you know protective behaviors like wearing helmet. So it is very very important that they do because it is a job motorcyclist hote hain unki because bahut zada hote hain roads pe. So kisi bhi tarah ek dusre ko agar speed up karte hue ya otherwise kisi aur ki negligence ki wajah se hit kar diya to it can cause damage to the brain or cause head injury. Then is HIV infection, um, kaise hota hai? Um, it is caused by HIV, HIV infection. Um, HIV infection is caused effect subcortical region of the brain. So HIV infection, jo ke humo, uh, human immunodeficiency infect, uh, virus hai, uski wajah se subcortical regions of the brain get affected and which in turn result in neurocognitive deficits. Risk factors jo hai HIV ke that is um, include uh, unprotected sex uh, and injections and drug use. Uh, um, there, is, there is a very important combination between substance abuse and HIV infection because wo jo, uh, drug through intravenously syringe ke through lagate hain aur aapas mein share karte hain uh, syringes so that has been very serious concern for um, health or clinicians or WHO ke ye bahut zyada uh, iski wajah se aids aur in, hiv hona shuru ho gayi thi kyunki agar unme se agar ek ko bhi hai to of course wo syringe jo hai infected syringe dusre ko lagegi teesre ko lagegi and three when there are um, so many other reasons blood transfusion is one of the another common reason ke bimar ko agar infected blood chala gaya to wo hiv usko bhi ho sakta hai uh, so the, these are the etiological factors uh, of hiv infection tbi stroke we have seen now, so we'll continue with the rest.